So welcome back and um, this is where we left off last time this installation. Um, this is just a quick video where I will customize it to be more friendly for YouTube. So make the font bigger and uh, change the background to something that's darker I think. And after that I'll be back uh, with something that's going to be more related to programming and I will also share the configuration files of this one of course uh, finally. So yeah let's I think I will mute this part and uh, fast forward until I have figured everything out. So, well, I think this is readable now, and it also looks pretty good, so that's fine. And the font should be now okay for desktop and also for mobile users uh, of um, YouTube. So, well, first of all, there are some things I want to change in my, um, yeah, for example that, because I'm still used to using Vim, I want to edit my uh, setsHRC file. And I think we can also clean this up a little bit because we don't need all the comments. Let's see if we want something of that. And there we have it, We've, uh, I forgot to put um, an equal sign here, so that's that. And that's, I don't think we need anything of that. So the git plugin is cool, so we do that. But the other thing, I don't think I need it, so let's delete them. So now it looks much better. But there are also some other things I think I want to have. Let's see, I think for a second. I 
I think what we also want is to enable correction for command autocorrection. And what else? Hmm. We also want to alias vi to send them and also v send them. And what else? Uh, to enable vim mode. I think that is it. So let's restart console again. Okay. Um, I think that is already it for this video and I will uh, continue with a Vim setup in the next video uh, which I will record uh, directly after this and yeah continue from there. I have a lot of ideas that, we want to, that I want to cover so yeah see you.